This is the VC1 series of Roland video converters. Jimmy, they're great little problem solvers. Yeah, look, they are. They're, they're, they're nice little sort of glue boxes. Um, mm. Uh, and the, the conversion quality is good. Typically, if you want a, a good quality conversion, or, or in the case of something like an embedder, um, which all of these do, uh, they've all got sort of additional functions beyond just their primary purpose in life. Mm. Uh, typically, if you wanted a good quality conversion in the past, you'd need to go to a rack-based sort mm. of card slot kind of solution, and then you, mm. you're into five digits straight away. Yeah, yeah. Um, these are nice because they're, they're compact, uh, they're not so small that you're going to get lost, and, uh, and they're, they're well built. Yeah, they are. They feel very solid. They feel very, very reliable. And just the ability to do things like, you know, also, you know, embed and de-embed uh, audio from SDI streams. Just those little extras. Yeah, yeah. So, for instance, this is the SDI to HDMI converter, um, which it does. Uh, and in the process of doing that conversion, you can embed audio onto your HDMI output, but you can also then get SDI out of it with the audio embedded and you can choose analog or AES as your audio input. That's yeah. really nice too. Yeah. Now configuration, you've either got the dip switches or a USB connection. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Um, the dip switches will cover you for pretty much all the major functions and especially if you're out in the field and you need to just change something quickly on the fly, the dip switches are good. If you're looking at something like this, which is the FS delay, um, this one will allow you to delay either audio or video uh, by half frame increments up to I think four and a half frames just from the dip switches and little rotaries but if you want to delay by a number of lines you can do that mm. but you need the software. Okay I believe your only gripe with this was the uh, power adapter. Yeah look uh, it's it's the, the gripe I've got with every device that uses an external power adapter with uh, but you know obviously it's it's probably a C approval thing. Uh, mm. Everyone does it. Uh, at least the, the adapter on this does seem to sort of click into mm. position uh, and there is a little screw on strain relief for the cable. Fair enough. So there you go, Roland VC1 series.